Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another video. As you can see, we're up early this morning and we're at a beautiful lake. Check this place out. This is actually a reservoir. I need to, I need to pay. I've never been here before. Okay, now that we got that cleared out of the way, it is time to launch the boat. There's one other guy out here. Just talked to him. He said he's brim and crappie fishing. But look at this, man. You you just know there's got to be bass. He said there's bass in here. And I've read some reviews about this place. It should be okay fishing. But yeah, let's just put the boat in the water before someone else gets here and tries to get to the boat ramp for me. Well guys, we're in, this is a pretty big reservoir. Um, I mean, I'm definitely not gonna be able to fish it all. I've got about two and a half, three hours to fish this morning. What I should have also said was I had just now brought my kayak up to college with me. So there is so many spots that I couldn't fish off the bank that I'm gonna be able to fish now. So I'm super excited to start kayak fishing up here. And yeah, this morning we're just chasing after bass. I have crankbait, Texas rig, jerkbait, Ned rig. I have all kinds of stuff that I want to throw. So let's throw it and see if we can get bit. Bass blowing up on bait over there. First sign of life I've seen. It was super, super shallow. He was right up against the grass. So I'm definitely gonna take a note of that. Makes me feel good about the top water. Ooh, ooh. Got hit. Yes, let's go. I got one, baby. I'm on the jerk bait. My second cast on the jerk bait. He's a little, but I got one. Got him. Yes. Oh, it's a spotted bass. Let's go. God, he got both trebles in him. Look at that, boys. Tiny, tiny fish, but so pretty. Spotted bass are just something else, man. Let's go for the release. But the way I caught that fish was I was just, I was actually paddling that way. And then I heard something splash. Look over here, saw bass were chasing bait. And then I came in with a jerk bait right here a little rapala jerk bait rapala however you want to say it and i threw that in there first cast got bit i already fished that with a ned rig but obviously they wanted something more aggressive i've caught both my fish on a jerk bait oh i see fish busting over there i think that is the pattern i just gotta chase these fish busting on bait fish throw the jerk bait at them and try to catch them i don't have a fish finder or anything but i think if i do this i can catch some more so I don't have a ton of time so i just gotta keep keep on casting two fish i caught a spotted bass which was cool and a large mouth they were both pretty small but you know a lot of these north georgia places i fish have not held very many big fish it's been a lot of small fish but hey 
caught two fish, didn't get skunked, so I can't be mad about it. That lake is a lot bigger than I thought. I barely covered any of it. I think I read that there was 15 miles of bank line, which is, that's a lot to fish on a kayak. But I caught both my fish on a jerk bait. The fish today seem to be feeding up very heavy on bait fish. It looked like they were busting, I'm assuming, shad on the surface of the water, so that's what helped me get some bites, throwing right where they were busting and catching them on jerk bait. So this lake was pretty decent, but it's not the only lake I've fished since I've had my kayak up here. I've actually fished two other lakes. I just didn't really film entire videos, didn't film intros and stuff just because of how, how busy the other lakes were. So I'm going to shoot you into the first lake I fished. I was just paddling around the bank fishing shallow with a wacky worm and yeah, I'm going to shoot you right into the footage. Oh yeah, there we go. Dang. <laughs> he jumped in the boat. <sighs> Check it out, boys. I thought it was a spotted bass for a second. That's why I was kind of like, oh my gosh, but just a little large mouth. But this is my first bass that I've caught out of a North Georgia lake. <laughs> he was about to jump and I didn't want him to splash me. But yeah, guys, for one, this is the biggest body of water I've ever put my kayak in. And for two, I'm in North Georgia, and that's really my first lake bass up here. So super excited to have the kayak up here. Honestly, did not expect to catch one as fast as I did. So that that's super promising. So let's just continue to fish, and maybe we can get another one. I don't think he's, oh, I don't know, he's decent. Oh, yeah. There we go. I was about to say, I don't think he's good, and then he started digging. Check that out. Little dink. But, man, they pull in here. The water's super, super deep. So I'm trying to cast up super, super shallow where this wacky rig can actually sink. Because if I get too far off the bank, I mean, it's never going to sink all the way down with how deep the water is. But like once that fish got off the bank a little bit, he started digging down in that deep water. So he, he had a little pull to him, but it wasn't very big. I'm starting to wonder if there's big fish in here or if it's just a bunch of small fish. Probably been fishing for about an hour. Got to not awful. So guys, I caught those two fish on the wacky worm pretty decent I mean nothing huge but they're, they're fun to catch and then after I caught those two I caught one more fish but let me tell you what happened with my GoPro the SD card like got corrupted I literally don't know how it happened but anyways I did not get the last catch on video and then also at the next lake that I fished at the first two fish catches I didn't get on video so I caught two more fish at the next lake on the wacky rig one of them was about a two pounder, but sadly I do not have that footage for you guys. But anyway, to that next lake, after I was throwing the wacky worm, I switched over to a crankbait, and I do have some catches on the crankbait on footage. So let me shoot you into that, lake number three. Let's see what happens. All right guys, a little update. It is now 10.15. I have fished all of that water over there. I've fished the dam, all that bank, and I've caught two fish and got one bite. That's not terrible, but after I caught those first two fish so fast, I figured more would have followed. Um, I've been fishing for a while without a bite, I'd, other than that last bite that I just got. But now I'm paddling across because I'm not gonna be able to fish all this just due to time because I do have work today. So I'm gonna try to hit all oh, this bank before I leave. I might have to fish it kind of fast, but hopefully we can pick up some fish. So yeah, I'm just gonna continue beating the bank Fishing shallow.
Oh, I got one. Yes. He's tiny, but yes. Look at that. <laughs> On the crankbait, baby. That is just sad. I literally just... Ah, oh, God. There we go. Almost got hooked there. Let me get the release. I literally just filmed that little update and then like a couple casts later, like my first couple casts on this bank, I got one. So that's kind of promising. First crankbait fish. Hopefully they'll keep biting it because I can fish this a lot faster than the worm. Oh, yeah, I still got him. I still got him. He's tiny. Oh, <laughs> I hooked him in the head. Look at that. <laughs> Another tiny one. guys in this video i fished three north georgia lakes with my kayak i'm glad i had the kayak up here glad to be fishing again i have a lot more spots i want to go to maybe even some really really big lakes so stay tuned for that if you like this video let me know by dropping a like comment and subscribe down below and let me know what other kind of videos you want to see down in the comment section below other than that i will just